Hello kids, let's learn about animals in winter. Look, winter is here. What would you like to do on a cold winter day? I wear my sweater and I'd like to have a cup of hot chocolate. Okay, then let me ask you a question. Animals don't have sweaters or mittens. Do you ever wonder what animals do in the winter? Yes, I do. What do animals do in winter? Winter is cold. There is little or no food around. Animals have three choices to survive the winter season. Some animals hibernate. Hibernate. Hibernation is like a deep, deep sleep. They curl up in a safe place and stay there all winter. Some animals migrate. Migrate. They go somewhere hot where they can find food. Other animals adapt. Adapt. They remain and stay active in winter by changing their body and behavior. Animals start planning for winter even when it's warm outside. In the fall, the weather gets cooler, days get shorter and the leaves change colors and fall off the trees. Soon, the winter will be here. The animals know that it's time to gather food and prepare for winter. Some animals start stocking up. Squirrels and chipmunks gather nuts in the fall and bury them in the ground. They will dig them up months later for a winter snack. Wow! In the fall, bears eat and drink as much as possible and gain weight for a long winter. Did you know that ladybugs fatten up feeding on other small insects to prepare for winter? That's awesome! And honeybees store honey for winter. Oh look! Winter is finally here! Oh! Winter is here! Some animals curl up in a cozy and safe place and stay there all winter. They hibernate. The animals that hibernate sleep through the winter. They don't move around for months. Their heartbeat and breathing slows down. They come out of the hibernation when the weather warms up. Bear is famously known for hibernating. Hedgehogs Groundhogs, chipmunks, and some snakes are some of the animals that hibernate. Okay! Can you name some animals that hibernate? Bear, hedgehog, groundhog, and snakes. Did you know that bats hibernate too? Wow! Some animals does not like winter. They migrate. They travel to places where the weather is warmer and where they can find food. They return back when the weather gets warmer in the spring. Animals like elk and caribou travel long distances to warmer places and in search for food. They travel with their families. Birds fly south. Geese are famously known for migration. They fly in groups in a V-shaped pattern. Whales migrate to have their babies and find food to feed them. They migrate to places with warmer and shallow water.
Did you know that monarch butterflies also migrate? That's awesome! Can you name some animals that migrate? Elk, monarch butterflies, geese, humpback whales. Wildebeest is also known for migrating in large groups. Okay! Some animals remain and stay active in winter. They adapt to the cold weather in the winter. They make changes to their body and behavior. To keep warm, they grow new and thicker fur or feathers. Some animals change their colors to white. Isn't that awesome? That's awesome! Look at this snowshoe hair. They change color to white as winter approaches. Their fur change from brown to white. The white fur helps them blend well with the snowy surrounding, protecting them from other animals. The Arctic fox is another animal which can survive cold winters. The Arctic fox changes color from brown in summer to white in winter. Arctic fox has its food pads covered in fur. These animals can find food in winter even though there isn't much food around. Snowshoe hares, weasels, arctic foxes and polar bears are some of the animals that adapt. Can you name some animals that adapt? Arctic fox, snowshoe hares, polar bear, and penguins are some of the animals that can adapt to winter. Awesome! Please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.